Hey everyone, this is Demonic Miss, and today I'm going to talk about the pros and cons of dashing as a door dasher. We're going to also talk about my personal experiences as well. I am so sorry about that. I will try to edit the door opening. My kid just woke up, so she came in here to say good morning to me. Uh, so if y'all, if I'm not able to edit out the door creaking, which depends on where it's at in my video, then, uh, that's what that was. So, where was I? Oh, yes. Uh, DoorDash has become a popular gig for many seeking flexible work and additional income. As a DoorDash and myself, I've experienced both the highs and lows of this job. In this video, I'll share my personal experiences, highlighting the pros and cons of Dashing, whether you're considered becoming a door dasher or just curious about the gig, I hope my insights will provide a clearer picture of what it's like. So we'll start with the pros of dashing. One, you got a flexible schedule. One of the biggest advantages of being a door dasher is the flexibility it offers. I can choose when and how long I want to work. This has been especially helpful when balancing other commitments like my streaming schedule and personal life. Number two, quick earnings. DoorDash allows you to get paid quickly. Earnings from dashing can be transferred to your bank account instantly with fast pay, which is a great option when you need cash on hand. I have it set so it automatically goes into my um, Dasher Direct account right away. And then when I get over a certain amount of money, then I transfer it to my bank account. And I move it where I need to. Number three, exploring new areas. Dashing has given me the opportunity to explore different parts of my city that I might not have visited otherwise. I've discovered new restaurants and scenic routes, making the job more enjoyable. Number four, meeting new people. Interacting with customers and restaurant staff can be a rewarding experience. While some interactions are brief, I've had pleasant conversations and met some interesting people along the way. Number five, independence. That is like the biggest pro. As a door dasher, you're your own boss. This independence allows you to manage your workflow and make decisions on the go. It's empowering to have control over my work environment. Now we'll discuss the cons of dashing as a door dasher. So one is inconsistent income. While the potential to earn is there, income can be inconsistent. Some days are busy with high earnings while others are slow. This unpredictability can be stressful, especially when relying on dashing as a primary source of income. Number two, wear and tear on the vehicle. Dashing involves a lot of driving, which can lead to increased wear and tear on your vehicle. Maintenance costs for gas, oil changes, Sorry about that. I got a phone call that I had to uh, take care of. Okay, so maintenance costs for gas, oil changes, and tires can add up quickly, cutting into your profits. Number three, dealing with customers. It's more like dealing with difficult customers, right? <laughs> uh, not every interaction is present is pleasant. There are times when orders are incorrect, customers are unresponsive, or you face rude behavior. Handling these situations can be challenging and frustrating. Number four, safety concerns. Safety is a concern, especially when delivering late at night or in unfamiliar areas. It's important to stay vigilant and trust your instincts, ensuring your, safe, your safety should always be a top priority. Number five, probably the worst part is the app glitches and technical issues. The DoorDash app isn't perfect. There have been instances where the app crashes, directions are incorrect, or orders disappear. These technical issues can disrupt your workflow and lead to delays.
Dashing as a door dasher has its fair share of pros and cons. The flexibility and independence are significant advantages, allowing for a unique and dynamic work experience. However, the inconsistent income, vehicle maintenance costs, and occasional safety concerns are notable downsides. For me, the positives often outweigh the negatives. Making DoorDash a worthwhile gig, if you're considering becoming a DoorDasher, weigh these factors carefully to determine if it aligns with your lifestyle and goals. Happy dashing! If you like this video, please feel free to hit like, subscribe, share. I hope it helps you. If you have any questions or would like to see more videos on DoorDash or being a dasher, by all means, leave it in the comments below and I will write it down in my planner. I do have more videos planned for this, so hopefully we'll get some going soon. Alright, thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you have a wonderful day.